Hello everyone, and welcome back to Weekend Cartoon Reviews. Sorry um, I didn't do one last week. I, I had a lot of stuff to do that weekend, so I unfortunately couldn't record. However, I'm doing this now. Anyway, Diary of a Wimpy Kid. <laughs> uh, what is there to really say about this one, to be honest? I mean, yeah, you got your characters like Greg, Rowley, Broderick, Manny, Susan, Frank, Fregley. Um, but just... Everyone's there, for the most part, really. Just, I felt like it was just kind of the same as the live-action one, in a way. Like, the live-action movie. It was pretty much the same, I'd say, for the most part. I mean, the live-action one, that was a good adaptation, but the animation one just feels a bit flat, in my opinion. It just feels rushed, the new one. Not to say that's bad. I thought it was fine, because it was almost practically the same thing. But, at the same time, though, eh, it's not that great. It's pretty disappointing, I'd say. Honestly, when this first was announced, I thought it was going to be some whole new movie. But then when it showed it was just a remake of the book, I'm like, okay, let's see if they'll do anything new. I mean, it doesn't seem like there's not a whole lot new here, for the most part. Like, I was hoping there to be some new scenes, just like the live-action one had some new scenes to surprise audiences. I wish this one did the same, in a way. Like, I, just 58 minutes, it, it was too short as well. It was, the characters felt a little underdeveloped. I mean, these are the same Greg and Rally everybody knows and loves, I guess. But I guess they're the same characters in a way. It just feels, it, it gets jarring at times, the movie, with how much they left out. Like, for instance, the cheese touch is barely even a part of the movie, to be honest. Like... It's not even a plot. It, the movie, to me, felt just like a slideshow of scenes from the book. To me, at least. I don't know if that's what other people think, because I haven't watched any reviews on it, but... Yeah, it's just... That's really all it is to me. Just a slideshow of stuff. Yeah. that That's really it. And then, of course, like, they left out some scene, uh, a few other scenes, like... One that I noticed was really left out was the one where, um, the kids are going into the hole or something like that. And Greg had them go into the hole or something. I mean, like, you still got some of the key parts of the book, I guess, like, uh, the Halloween scene and, um, the zooey mama. Greg gets jealous of Rally or something. Some, just, you got those scenes in there, and then there's just some you don't have. So it was really jarring and pretty disappointing in that way. Just wasn't that good. I mean, like, the movie was meh. It's okay, I guess. Just, it felt like just the same thing as the the animated, not the animated, the live-action movie we've all seen. That's, that's really it to say about it. There's not a whole lot to say about it. Everything can be said for the animation one that can almost be said for the live-action one. Kind of. Kind of. Not completely. Because the live-action one was definitely better. This animation one is just... I mean, the style works. What really pulled me in for this one was the style of the animation. It, it felt like the books. That was nice. That was good to look at, at least. But then, you have the other scenes. I mean, like, Roderick's barely even in the whole thing, which makes this thing out even more disappointing. Yeah. Which, Roderick was a key part in the books, I'd say. Like, at least the first book, he was one of the main characters. Probably, I guess. I mean, he's one of the family members who was shown a lot. And then, yeah, and then, that's really it. I mean, Frank also barely has any speaking lines, I guess. I mean, I barely heard anything from him in the movie. Like, really, all, all the, real, the main focus, of course, should always be on Greg and Rally. And they are the main focus here, don't get me wrong. But, like, they, they were a little bit too focused on, like, the character, some of the characters felt a little too underdeveloped. That's what I'm trying to say there, but... All in all, see this if you want to kill some time, I guess. I mean, I tried saying a lot for this one, but I just can't say a lot for this one because, you know, it, it just... Eh. That's really all it is to me. It's just eh. Because it's pretty much the same for the book. I mean, the movie I got some laughs out of, but this one I didn't get a whole lot of laughs out of it. Probably because of the short runtime and how fast-paced it was and how... Barely anything connected to me for the most part. Maybe I'm shitting on this movie a little too much, 
But this is just my honest thoughts. Like, I don't hate the movie. It's not the worst thing ever. No, of course not. It, it just, meh. That's all it is to me. Just, meh. It's okay. It's a good time killer, I guess. But that's really all it is. It's one of the shortest animated films Disney made. And there's just, just, eh. It's really it. And then there's going to be more animation adaptations of the books. Hopefully they make those longer than 58 minutes. Because personally, this was advertised as a movie. Like a full movie. But it, it's not even, the whole thing's not even an hour long. Which, and that's disappointing. I mean, come on now. Anyway, that's really it. See ya.